Hello. I'm Brother Patrick of the English Department. May I show you around the university? We are located on the highest hill in Austin, the capital of Texas. This large campus was a gift to Father Edward Soren, the founder of Notre Dame University. And in 1885, he founded St. Edward's here. But Father Soren would not recognize much of the modern St. Edward's. Our present campus contains over 15 buildings dominated by the main building, which houses, among other things, the administrative offices. We'll go to the office of the university president, Brother Edmund Hunt, CSC, PhD in classics from the University of Chicago. This picture you are viewing is an introduction St. Edward's, a liberal arts Catholic college where the size enables the faculty and the students to know one another fairly well. And in Texas, where the weather is supposed to make you glad to be alive. We believe that we have the essentials of the triangle which Christian education ought to be, secular, social, and moral. For instance, we offer the practical courses which enable a young man to earn a living, to think logically, and to imbibe some of the culture of the ages which we call humanism. Secondly, we offer the usual extracurriculars in sports, clubs, and other activities in which a man can learn to live amicably and justly with his fellow man in society. And finally, in a world where people pay lip service to God and religion, but do very little about it, we offer formal classes in religion and uh, habit-forming practices where we live together as a faculty and a student body men of like ideals. And this cannot be done in institutions supported by taxes. We think all these three phases are important in education. St. Edward's is proud of its 75 years of service in education. It is proud of its alumni, of its present faculty and present students. As president, I take this occasion to welcome you pictorially to our campus and to a real visit at any time you should be in Austin. Religiously, the life of the campus is centered in Our Lady of Victory Chapel.
the grotto of Our Lady of Lourdes offers a quiet place of outdoor prayer. Father Morrison, the religious counselor to the students. You know, of course, Clarence, that we're going to have some devotions in honor of Our Lady at Seton Hospital this coming Sunday. Do uh, you plan on attending? Fine. Well, we'll count you in then, Clarence. And uh, I'm sure you're going to be very much inspired and edified by the proceedings. Our students also take part occasionally in religious activities off campus. Here is the university's float in a Knights of Columbus parade up Congress Avenue in Austin. Academically, St. Edward's has much variety. Here is Father O'Brien about to begin a religion class. The condition of the world today is very confused. This confusion is caused by the absence of God from the minds and hearts of men. The remedy for this confusion is to know God, to know his laws, and to keep them this is done by the means of grace which God has given us, prayer and the sacraments. Next, we have Brother Magella in a philosophy class. Because man has ideas, he has language, he has reasoning power, he has moral idealism and responsibility, he has the sciences, he has philosophy. He has the arts and architecture. Apes have none of these things. Apes cannot talk in the first place because they have no ideas. Apes cannot talk because they have nothing to talk about. This is Brother Mel Kyle, head of the chemistry department, conducting an experiment in organic chemistry. In the engineering laboratory, Brother Barry demonstrates an experiment in electrical engineering.
economics. Remember well, gentlemen, that the two chief causes of insecurity are unemployment and industrial accident. Remember well also that every economic system is measured by its ability to provide economic security to its members. Obviously, we draw our faculty from all parts of the country. Mr. O'Hare from Boston. Did you say Boston, brother? You mean Boston. Okay, Boston. Athletically and socially, also, the life at St. Edward's is a full one. There are four major varsity sports. Basketball. Golf. Besides varsity sports, there are many others, such as swimming. Horsemanship. Volleyball. Touch football. <laughs> and softball. This is intramural competition. Culturally, the Glee Club is an important activity on the campus. There are no books like a day. Publications also called for student talent. Say, Bob, why don't you go out and get the, that shot of the tower now? What do you want from the front or the back? Oh, it really doesn't matter, just so long as it's a good one. Okay. The tower from the rear. 
students don't forget that food is also important. This is a student waiter paying part of his tuition in this way. Other students do secretarial work, farm work, and lawn cutting. Holy Cross Hall is one of the student residences. A student hard at work. Also in Holy Cross Hall is the studio of our student radio station which at present limits its broadcast to our campus alone. This is station KSEU broadcasting from atop Holy Cross Hall. We will now play 15 minutes of your favorite music. spot for recreation. of sickness, we have our own infirmary with daily attendance by a physician and registered nurse. The Austin area offers many amusement spots, for instance, Barton Springs. Every year, a number of our former students enjoy having a reunion at St. Edward's. The present students like to meet and entertain the former ones in a very informal way. She's supposed to have a cue, and what she do? She's over there making love to Olegas. <laughs> Take a letter, Miss Dahl. Yes. To all departments, you know, the usual. Yes. Make ten copies. Yes. Uh, Catherine! Catherine! Hey! Catherine! Right. Am I not the greatest producer in Hollywood? Yes, yes Mr. Paddock. <laughs> right. Call up all my directors, oh, Miss Dahl. Yes, sir. Tell them they're fired. Yes, sir. Now I'll direct all the pictures myself. Yes, sir. Conference! Conference! <laughs> ah, am I not the greatest director in all Hollywood? Yes, yes Mr. Okay, Fire. okay, please. I said the conference was over. I'm a reporter. You're fired. You can't fire me this time because I'm not working for you. 
here to investigate Hollywood. An investigation. Call Washington, oh, Miss Dahl. Yes, sir. Hey, fellas. Hey, hey what, what's the matter? Wait a minute, wait a minute! <laughs> there, there. Hey, hey. I guess that's it. <laughs> well, to get on with the next act, uh, we have a guy named Alan Skidmore. <laughs> the students sponsor many dances during the year. This one is the senior ball. Every year, commencement exercises climax all activities. And so they go forth to meet life, holding in their hands a document with the seal of St. Edward's. In this student are concentrated all the phases of education at St. Edward's, social, academic, and most important of all, religious. Hail 